What is up, guys, and welcome to the Blue Eyes Chaos Max Ritual slash Dogmatica action profile from this past weekend at Locals. Uh, Bantlers came out, so I think I believe the next format is the weekend coming up after this profile comes up. So I think it's uh, June 3rd and the 4th, I think it's the first weekend it's live or the weekend after that i know it's coming up but yeah but decided to take blue eyes uh chaos drag and uh, let's say dogmatic out because honestly extra deck stuff is kicking a lot of uh i see a lot of decks are very reliant on extra deck right now so having a deck that really focuses on taking that out is really good but yeah without further ado let's just get right into it uh namesake of course uh the normal chaos max uh yeah this is just three standard of course nothing too crazy with that double piercing um uh, <laughs> Uh, it's saying the meme, uh, I say can't be targeted or destroyed by card, I say opponent's card effects, so yeah, not that bad. Uh, on top of the, I say dragon rituals, we do have one in math for, I say, I say a math factor of pain. This guy is one of the, I say many floodgates things we have in this deck that just counteracts the extra deck, so yeah, uh, yeah, as he's out, the effects of fusion, synchro succeeds, uh, it cannot be activated, so yeah, pretty, uh, pretty dope. Uh, then of course we have first three blue eyes you can't have a blue eyes deck without a blue eyes some people say it's bricky i do kind of tend to agree with that a little bit but i still like the three it's just iconic i mean i can't not run in that three uh two alternatives simple uh it's free special summon uh, we do run a rank eight engine in this as well uh, is a little bit to get things going and get things moving so there is that so yeah next of course the more ritual we have three koju of the t t uh say trillion hands this guy really combos off really nicely because on his summon, he searches out any ritual monster and ritual spell, so he searches through the whole thing. So, yeah, that's pretty dope. And then to help summon him out, of course, are the incantations. Uh, these guys special summon by just revealing a ritual spell or a ritual monster in your hand. They special summon each other out. So, basically, these guys just special out. You normal summon kills you because he's your primor primary normal summon anyway. Searches out your engine, uh, gets everything kind of just going, so... Yeah, can't complain with that. Um, like I said, this weekend performed, performed really, really, really well. So, can't can't complain with that. Uh, so, yeah, that's it for, like, the monsters and the, let's say, blue eyes stuff. I, I, I say split it up with the, let's say, blue eyes and the dogmatica stuff. So, that's still coming up. But, yeah, uh, searching this deck does a lot of it because it's a blue eyes deck. It essentially is a, br a really bricky deck. So, we have ways to just keep our consistency, search out things. Uh, say, what, like, three melody, for example. Broken card. Uh, three bingo. Bingo again. Uh, this nuts. More search. Search. Uh, searches anything really, you really want. Uh, next, we have of course the two, uh, ritual spells. Now we have two chaos form, and then two advanced ritual arts because we can send uh, these two hand in hand are really good together. Also, we do run the one ultimate fusion to go into the blue eyes alternative ultimate dragon as well because that card is pretty damn good. Uh, Dogmatica still one white knight of oh, Dogmatica is the one ritual launch we have. Um, just gets rid of something. Oh, your opponent's extra deck gains a bunch of attack. Level eight. See, synergizes with the deck really well. It's re I see white relic is good too, but it's a level four, so it's kind of just off-putting a little bit. So, and then of course the Dominic engine is kind of just kind of I see small in this deck because uh, we have one Ecclesia, one Fertilize, and then one of the Maximus uh, to round out like our Dogmatica monsters. Uh, so yeah. Then of course we have the three uh, Nadir Servant to search them out. So you can't go wrong with that. And then, of course, one Punishment, and then the one Schism to round out our Dogmatica engine. Um, insane. Uh, level, uh, let's see, level 8s definitely help with it. Uh, let's see, setting from the extra deck the graveyard allows a lot of our cards to pop off. Now, just kind of like board-breaking cards. Uh, say three, uh, I say two lava golem, and then of course dark ruler no more. If you want to make the room and make the space, you also can throw in pot of prosperity or pot of pro uh, say extravagance in because we do not rely on our extract at all, really. It's mostly just an OTK main deck uh, build, but yeah, but th that's up to you guys. Uh, extra deck, the exceeds package we really want to go into every once in a while for OTKs is of course the Titanic clad, Dragubion, and of course the Numeron dragon. This is just our big OTK enabler uh, package that we have for the extra deck. Next, of course, we have Nexus Pop. No, it's standard. Uh, of course, we have one Titanic Lad to search out any Dogmatica monster if we send. So it's just lost to get a missing piece. Uh, of course, we have the one Garua to draw a card. Two of the Heralds to search anything as well, like Ritual, Spell, or Monster. So those are kind of our sending cards we like to send. Uh, our Shadal package is Winda Construct and, of course, Alp Cologne. This is your standard shawl, because Winda is just absolutely just mean. Uh, <laughs> Floodgate. Then, of course, uh, 
a Camerphlegia. This is a way to search out the Ultimate Fusion in case you just want to go for that and just blow everything up. Then we do have uh, two more Fusion. We have the Twin Burst. Twin Burst we can just make without Fusion, so it really don't matter in case we do have like two blue eyes white uh, dragons on the field. So it's rare, but it can come up. And of course, we have the one alternative ultimate to just round out. But yeah, Chaos Max, still cool, super fun. Uh, the Dogmatic Package really elevates it to another level, in my opinion, because it just gives it so much little... Uh, it, it gives it a little consist say, consistency boost, plus it's just an annoying package as well. I'm definitely gonna, I'm definitely working on pure Dogmatic Ritual as well, because I really love that deck. It's really, I'm really taking a big liking to that. But yeah, but that will come in a future video, so stay tuned for that. And of course, we got the new format coming up with uh, tons of things that are coming up. Uh, I say Sky Strikers for sure, because I I love Sky Strikers, but having, say, three multi roll and two engage back, basically, Sky Strikers are absolutely at full force almost again. So, can't wait to see how that performs in the upcoming format. So, yeah, but that's it for the Blue Eyes Chaos Max profile. So, so, thank you guys for watching. Until my next video, stay safe and stay healthy out there. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.